Hello everybody, in this video I will show to you how to make some salt gel electrolyte which you can use in your batteries. Uh, I already made this video uh, about gel polymer electrolyte based on potassium hydroxide but a lot of you guys ask me how to make some gel electrolyte uh, from some salt material uh, and yeah first of all in this beaker I have 30 milliliters of water into this 30 milliliters of water I use uh, zinc sulfate uh, and I add 23 grams so 23 grams zinc sulfate into 30 milliliters of water the solution too uh, is here I also add 30 milliliters of water in this beaker but into this beaker I will add this this is a mix from 4 grams of borax this one I buy on eBay and also 4 grams of gelatin so here I have 4 grams of borax and also 4 grams of gelatin so this beaker which I have here 30 milliliters of water I will add on the hot plate and I will also stir and when the water will be hot I will add this mix so I will put this beaker on my hot plate and into this water I will add this mix and now into this mix I will add uh, this zinc sulfate I need to stir a little bit because the zinc sulfate is not entirely dissolved And now you get this. Voila. So I will try this in my battery to see if this works. So I covered the zinc metal with this uh, electrolyte. Uh, actually, it's really easy to work with because you need to only press down and that's it. So the cat out. Hmm. And let's see if the battery works.
Yes, 1.5 volt. And now the electronic load. And I will run a couple of minutes. And yeah, the battery works. One point three volts. Yeah, nice. So in basic how to make this uh in the first speaker you add uh, 30 milliliters of water, 20, uh, 23 grams of zinc sulfate. In another beaker you add 4 grams of gelatin and 4 grams of borax into 30 milliliters of water. Uh, but the water need to be hot on 80 degrees C and also you need to stir when you add borax and gelatin and uh, when the solution uh, is uh, is on the temperature of 80 degrees C you add the solution of zinc sulfate and you get this so actually you see some tiny parts Really nice. So, I don't know if this one is interesting to you, but yeah, this is one way to make some gel uh, salt electrolyte. So guys, this is the battery which uses this uh, gel zinc sulfate electrolyte. Uh, this is the discharge curve right now uh, works really really great uh, I think that this type of salt gel electrolyte is quite easy and you can try by yourself uh, actually I don't know if uh, another sulfate like uh, magnesium sulfate will work because I try only this zinc sulfate right now uh, but yeah maybe it will also work with magnesium sulfate or other sulfates uh, you need to try it and you will see what you will get uh, so actually that's it for now and we see us in the next video bye